And I really kind of, I, I read one book the whole time I was in high school. But the luck of the draw was that book was To Kill a Mockingbird. And it had just come out. It came out, I think, in 60, and I got it in 61. And it was brand new, so my brother didn't have an old To Kill a Mockingbird report. So, you know, I opened it up thinking that maybe I could get the report off the flap. But it was way more about Harper Lee than it was about the book, so I was stuck. And I started to read it, and I, I couldn't believe it was a book. I mean, number one, the author was still alive. It was the first book I'd read by an author who was still alive. My, my English teacher kind of liked the classics. And I look back at it, and I think it had such a such an huge effect on me because it seemed like Scout was my friend. I mean, I read that book three times before I realized Harper Lee wrote it, or before I could at least tell you who wrote it. I thought Scout wrote it. It just had that it had that feel to it, and the intimacy that I felt. I mean, it was like I never read a book cover to cover without you know in one sitting. But boy, I, I could. It was like I wanted to sit down and read it again. And that stuck with me. And I, I, I kind of went through college a little bit the same way, in fact, a lot the same way. And I, w I was a psychology major. I was more interested in kind of why people do what they do than I was in, in putting anything down. But I knew I liked words and I knew I liked stories. And I would, yeah, I might not get them out of books, but I liked to hear them, I liked movies, I liked all that kind of stuff. Well, part of the luck of the draw for me was that I was hanging out when I, w I was out at Eastern the, the university, not the hospital. <laughs> and and uh, I, was, I, went, I went through college about the same time as Terry Davis did. And he's another Spokane author. If you, if you, you can still see the, the book they, or the movie they made out of his first book, Vision Quest. And Terry and I were good friends in college. And I went down, when I got out of college, I went down to the Bay Area. I was down in, around Berkeley and San Francisco and all that. And I was working in an alternative school down there. And Terry was over at Stanford on a, on a writing scholarship. And we'd meet once a week, and he was writing Vision Quest. And he would read me a chapter. And he'd say, all I want you to do is tell me what works and what doesn't work. I just want to know if you believe it or don't believe it. So I would say, most of it I believe, but once in a while there'd be something I'd go, yeah, I don't know. And he'd fix it. And then he'd bring it back, and he'd read it again, and it was better and better and better. And when he got finished with it, I thought, Wow, he didn't do anything I couldn't do if I'm willing to do the rewrites. 